Well, I gather President Adams was not a little miffed. Apparently the White House wanted us all to go on talking. Huh. Talk about giving a man on the guillotine an aspirin. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Until Maguadora recognises Britain's right to sovereignty, there could be no question of pulling out our troops. Absolutely. Uh, uh, madness. And now to another equally serious problem. The record level of unemployment. Now, some people argue this crisis is the result of government mismanagement and underspending. Well, they could not be more wrong. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. Because we all know what really causes unemployment in this country, don't we, gentlemen? Unemployment in this country is caused by pixies. I don't mean the nice, ordinary ones who sit on toadstools playing a whistle. I'm talking about the nasty, evil, malevolent pixies. The tiny green ones with the black pointy beards who go around our factories, and we've all seen them, who go around our factories casting their wicked spells and bringing about mass redundancies on a scale not witnessed since the Great Depression. <laughs> when did you actually form this theory, Prime Minister? Well, to be perfectly honest, Nigel, the uh, pieces only really sort of gelled in my mind, so to speak, last weekend. I was up visiting a factory in Stockport. Literally hundreds had lost their jobs, and small wonder, the place was crawling with them. With, um, pixies? Yeah, pixies, sprites, elfin folk, all manner of goblinry. Certainly opened my eyes, I can tell you. And that's why I've launched this new campaign. I see. What campaign? The Stamp Out Evil Pixies campaign. The public have got to be educated on this one, Nigel. 